Today, I have to honour my promise. I've resigned as your Member of Parliament and I'll be standing in the by-election as an independent candidate. We elected Zach twice on the premise that the government would not give the go-ahead for further expansion of Heathrow and if they did, he would trigger a by-election. This by-election is our opportunity to demonstrate our commitment to fighting Heathrow expansion. There will be more than a million people impacted by an expanded Heathrow. We're going to mobilise those people and we're going to get them to flex their muscles as you are. It'll be a dark day for people who would lose their homes and their communities. And when Zach Goldsmith announced that he was going to keep his promise, that was a light in their dark days. We need champions in this fight. People who are prepared to build barricades by taking serious political risks. We're prepared to say that we back Zach. The question is not who can do this, who will do that? Look at my record. You know that if you put me back in Parliament, I will win the arguments with those MPs. There is a reason why Heathrow singled out Zach Goldsmith. They know if Zach loses, Heathrow will win. Zach is a very principled, hard-working MP. One of his main issues was to stop Richmond Park parking charges, leading the campaign to bring in 30-minute free parking so that the local shops would be helped, setting up the new secondary school, the Kingston Academy, and particularly standing up for Kew Gardens. So Zach has really delivered for our community. He's been so independent-minded in Parliament and prepared to work cross-party with other MPs on environmental issues. The illegal wildlife and ivory trade, the designation of huge marine protection zones around British overseas territories. No other MP has been as effective on green issues as Zach Goldsmith. Zach has always found the accountability of MPs very important. And his recall campaign to make MPs more accountable to their voters was superb. The only people who are qualified to define if an MP is behaving well or badly, living up to expectations or not, are the people that MP represents. It should come as no surprise that other parties are trying to make this by-election about other issues. But the truth is, this by-election is happening because of Heathrow expansion. Heathrow and the government will be watching this by-election closely. If we don't back Zach to be our MP, we're not only losing a wonderful MP, but the message that we are be sending them will be confused and ignored. But we can send a strong, clear message by re-electing Zach Goldsmith. We may not all agree with him on Heathrow, but we can agree on one thing, his track record it show he put community before his party or any ambition. I'd hoped that this by-election would never be necessary, but it was, and I wasn't prepared to break my word to you. As your independent MP, I will be an even stronger representative for our area, working constructively with government where they get it right, holding government to account where they get it wrong, just as I have over the last six years as your MP. I hope you'll consider voting for me on December the 1st so that I can return to Parliament and continue working for and delivering for our wonderful community.